are up here in the mountains, you guys. I hear a plane, but I don't see it. Oh, it's actually, if y'all can focus it right, y'all can't see it, it's in the clouds now, but we are in the mountains. It's so, so pretty here. He enjoying himself. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. We don't get this in Texas, man. This is why we travel. Really? So we out here, still in the mountains. It's cold as hell. What did he say? It was like 40 some degrees up here right now? Yeah, like 48, I think. Look how pretty, you guys. Yeah, it's beautiful. Man. It's beautiful. I really wish you could see what I see, but. I feel like I'm on top of the world. It's so pretty. You guys, this is the prettiest part that we've seen so far. It's just mountains sitting on mountains and mountains and mountains. The clouds are sitting right above. It just looks like a piece of art work. Piece of heaven. It is raining. There's airplanes flying above us, but we can't see anything up here. Yeah, not at all. It's very windy here. A little chilly. We have on t-shirts and shorts. <laughs> but we've been up here a while. It's time to go get some. <sighs> I just need to turn my seat warmer back on because it is cold, honey. You look so good, babe. How you liking the car? I'm loving it. I'm telling you, I'm buying one now. I know that's Straight right. Up. What, babe? You didn't want lemon on it? No, it looked good. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, this is some boiled shrimp. We are at Bubba Gums, downtown Denver, um, enjoying a nice little hot meal before we leave. So we got some shrimp to start, and I don't know what we're gonna order next, but this is what we're starting with, is the shrimp. Mm-hmm, start with the shrimp. I know you're gonna get coconut shrimp. Maybe, or I might get the seafood pasta. I really don't know what I wanna get yet, That's but. That's what I'm probably gonna get. With the pasta? Yeah. Then I'll get the coconut shrimp. That way you can have both things you want. Okay. How's the shrimp, babe? It's actually really good. Oh, yay. So you're going to get the pasta so I can eat some of your food, too. You better be glad I don't eat coconut shrimp. And then I'm going to get some coconut shrimp and have them all to myself. <laughs> so right. I love you, babe. Happy wife, happy life. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to dip it in this pineapple. It looks like a pineapple dipping sauce. Let's see. That was good, huh? I can tell. <laughs> mm -hmm. Squeeze a little bit of lemon up on there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You were honest the first time. It's not. His pasta barely hit that fine. Let me taste it and see. Where is it? Yes, you taste it. Dish. It's not bad. It don't taste like an unhealthy pasta, you know what I'm saying? 
Very good for scampi. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like it's it's good. You know, it's not bad. So I gave him. I, I gave do him a seven. Yeah, I gave him a seven. I raised it. Yeah, it's good. This scampi sauce is good. I taste the garlic. I taste the herbs. I exactly. taste the, the white taste wine, everything. the butter, everything. The tomato. It's pretty, pretty good. So the food at Bubba Gump's in Denver <clears throat> and the service was probably the best that oh, we've had night. at any restaurant. Look how beautiful it is out here. We're leaving the restaurant now. How was your food, babe? Food was good, man. Like I said, 7 out of 10. Yeah. It's a nice a light meal. They didn't give me too much, so I still feel good. I don't feel stuffed. I love it. Yeah. We ate. We're leaving now. About to hop in the in the ride, and I think I want to go get ice cream. So we're gonna go get ice cream and probably just relax for the night. It's been a good vacation, a quick little getaway. We wanted to go somewhere quick, somewhere chill, and we did just that. So ooh, I'm trying to get in the car move everything around you know what I'm saying but yeah it's been a good time I've really enjoyed it I think he's really enjoyed it I know he's really enjoyed it actually <clears throat> and yeah Bubba Gums is definitely a good spot to go for a quick meal good service you know I don't know if it's because the other restaurants we went to were in the middle of like the hustle and bustle but the people like the management and staff it, it like it's unreal compared to back home back home i feel like people are happy to serve you happy to have you there happy to have your money you know what i'm saying these places down here just has they haven't cared <laughs> not even a little bit but bubba gump i will tell you 10 out of 10 i really appreciate them ice cream in the rain y'all look at this <laughs> it's pouring raining and we are stuck our car is at the hotel we have not found an Uber. There are no scooters around. And we are blocks away from our room. I could literally scream right now. Oh my goodness. What are we gonna do? Find us an Uber. Do. Did you we, find we us an Uber? We're gonna walk through this rain. No, we not. Y'all. A little water ain't never hurt nobody. I am not walking in this rain. We don't have no umbrella or nothing. Well, we need to go buy an umbrella. No, it is this bad. It is this bad. Okay, well, come on, let's go. Oh, now you with it? Let's go. Yeah. Hey, we'll survive. The whole hey, poncho on. Hey, you're a genius, on. man. Man, with the scooter. <laughs> like, if I could have that right now, I'm just, I can't even enjoy my ice cream. It's about to be water and cream. I'm going to take a few more bites. Y'all. Yeah. Woo! Who would have known? It is pouring rain, like... At least they're jamming over there. It was not like this 15 minutes ago. If so, we would have drove, of course, you know, like 
The hey, bunk here it was sunny. It was hey, beautiful. It like Texas. I think it might be a little bit like a little bit worse. It probably is. Like in Texas, we know. You know if it's gonna rain, if it rain, if it's gonna really rain, or if it's gonna sprinkle and then stop. How being around the mountains, it's kind of like being close to the ocean. Like the weather just changed. Wow, it's pretty cool. I mean, wow. Talk about some up and down weather, and then it's cold out here, y'all. Like I don't have no hoodie with me. My jacket is in the room. Hey, bucket. Let's we go. gotta go. Let's go. Okay, we're almost to the cover part. I'm about to throw this shit away. Good. What the? Oh, that's a recycle bin. Okay. Hello. <laughs> Can I get some dry clothes over here? Right you, nobody open? Nobody's open to go shopping right now. Yeah. But you know what? It's good I just threw something on to come get ice cream because Ooh. How you feeling? I feel good, man. Look, he didn't take a shower or change anything yet. That's exactly what I'm about to go do. Take a shower. My ass showered, threw clothes on. I was like, come on, let's go get ice cream. And then <laughs> We hit the pouring rain. It's raining. We got another block to the hotel. We got stuck by that little red hen at the corner. Okay. Still beautiful though. Bae, you all right? No. You all right, bae? No. No? No. <laughs> Good morning, YouTube family. We are actually checking out now. Poppy is getting everything in the car. Last night, the rain was crazy. We literally got inside, showered, got ready for bed. It's been a great trip. Yeah, y'all. He had to put one of our luggage in the trunk and then the other one in the hood. They both would not fit in the trunk. Did you get it, babe? Yeah, it's all in the back. Oh, okay, I, I thought you put one in the trunk and one in the... Trunk. Yeah. <laughs> nah, one in the hood and one in the trunk. That's what I just told them you did. The runner front is a little too small for a suitcase. Oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't know they both were going to fit in the back, y'all. It looked really small, so... Yeah, they fit them, man. I made it work. Okay, so we're going to grab coffee and breakfast before we head to the airport. I love you guys. He loves you too. I Even do if love y'all too. <laughs> like, we love y'all. <laughs> I know I don't say it enough. I don't say it enough. Hey, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. Hey, Mimosa for our breakfast. We're at Smooth eating before we head to the airport. I have a pancake flight. I have some hash right here with some vegan meat on top. It's like a chorizo, plant-based chorizo. I don't know if you guys can hear me, but I hope you can. With onions and cheese on top. It looks damn, damn good. He has breakfast tacos. I know. <laughs> he has breakfast tacos, it looks like, with potato, egg, bacon, and cheese. Um, some fresh pico salsa on the side. We got coffee. We got everything we need. You know, we had Snooze, so if you've ever been to Snooze, you know you can't go wrong. I never had a bad experience here. All the food is good. I recommend it to anybody. I'm trying something new. I got a venti strawberry lemonade with some raspberry in it. It's pretty good. I'm trying something new too. I got a cold brew with vanilla and sweet cream and it's pretty good. Oh, okay. It's pretty good too. 
We're about to get ready to head home. You need to use your small portable electronic devices, your cell phones, tablets, and e-readers, but they do need to be held in your hands. At this time, your flight crew is going to come by one final time. So we've already been here for over two hours. We're in Houston. We were on one plane. Something went wrong. Maintenance could not fix it. They switched us to another plane. Maintenance cannot fix this. We're gonna at least be here for another hour and a half. At least is what they're expecting as of right now. I don't know what we're about to do. I'm thinking about canceling our flight in the night here uh, and flying right here. back to Austin tomorrow but, or renting a car because this is ridiculous at this point like we should have been home hours ago we're exhausted we've been gone all week we just ate dinner thank God so we're full but we're just sitting <laughs> waiting <laughs> And there's hey, what's, so many what's worse, what's worse than this right here that rained last night? <laughs> it's probably this. Definitely this. What you say? Definitely this. 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 Y'all, we've been here for hours. Yeah. It's crazy. And then the flight, getting back to Texas was just rocky, to say the least. Yeah, I don't even know what I'm to say rocky what to right now. They're having technical difficulties on the flights they're not able to get them fixed the only other plane available is leaving from chicago right now on the way to houston so again that's not even available for us to leave tonight at all so we are heading to go see if we can get our luggage i made the reservation for the car we are going to run a car y'all we've been in this airport for what like three Three and a half hours. Three and a half hours. This is ridiculous. I'm tired. I'm ready we to be home. home. It's seven o'clock. Y'all, and it's pretty late. It's like ten o'clock already. So we'll keep y'all posted.